my channel is me Uli. Today I'm gonna react to my favorite Nukes Top 5. Thank you guys for 15k. I have to stop and say that. I'm so like happy. Thank you for all the support you guys. You guys are the best. And yeah, subscribe, like, and comment. Follow me on IG start at Uli. And let's get it. Can't wait. Five ghosts caught on camera. Found footage. Popular Japanese paranormal YouTube channel Fourth Wall has found another incredibly creepy video from the internet of an alleged very strange haunting in Japan. The video is said to have been posted to the internet by an anonymous man who says he was exploring an abandoned house and found two cameras that someone had simply left behind. He says that when he checked the recorded footage from the camera's wow. memory cards, he was shocked by what he found. Did you see it? The man looks behind him, but there's nothing there. Then something seems to startle him, and when he looks again, this time a bizarre, unexplained figure is standing nearby, seemingly just staring. Suddenly the camera falls to the ground, but we don't hear anyone run away. In fact, we don't even hear anyone move. The internet poster who found the cameras in the empty building says he has no idea what happened to the camera's owner. It's almost as if the explorer simply disappeared into thin air, never to be seen again. You can check out more scary Japanese videos over on the YouTube channel, Fourth Wall. That's crazy. What lurks in the shadows? Chris from the YouTube channel, Urbex Hill is back on- What do you guys think that was? He said the guy wasn't, what? I'm so like, he probably just didn't want to, I don't know. I don't know what, I think that's real, man. That really happened. That really is creepy as hell. Like, I can't even, like, how? Like, that really was real to me. That was weird. The urban exploration to an abandoned temple in East Cleveland, Ohio. The unique structure was built in 1905 and served as a Masonic temple before it was abandoned in the mid-2000s. Chris makes his way through the structurally damaged property to capture the temple's unique architecture on film. Viewers of Chris's YouTube channel point out in the comments that a strange voice seems to say, hey, as Chris passes by. Now, maybe the creepy voice could simply be explained as some odd outside noise picked up by Chris's microphone. But what happens next is a little harder to explain. It's really sad that they let this historical place fall apart like this. Wow, look at this. I'm 
look at every corner to see. A shadow-like figure can be seen in a doorway. It appears to be shifting back and forth slightly before it just seems to disappear into that. thin air. I was trying so hard. Chris though. is completely alone in the building and has no idea what he has wow. just captured on camera. He only noticed the figure when reviewing his footage later. Right. Yeah, so know. what do you think I this could be? That. Let me know down in the comments. Black Shadow. You can find more of Chris's amazing urban explorations and occasional possible paranormal encounters over on his YouTube channel, Urbex Hill. We I can't explain that. That was weird as hell. I don't know. That's I can't explain that. But that's Black Shadow. But I didn't even catch that at all. But that was something else. Like these two videos are real to me. I feel like world. A segment where all the very strange videos go. First up, a man named Corey says that he works the night shift and arrived home late one night to find his large dog cowering in the kitchen. Curious to see what had upset his poor dog, Corey checks his security footage. The CCTV captured something that Corey just can't explain. seems to be bothered and then startled by something in the corner of the living room. The dog growls and stares at the spot before suddenly yelping in absolute terror and fleeing the room in a panic. Now it's unclear what it is that seems to attack the dog and Corey believes that it might be related to the supernatural as Corey says he has had some odd experiences in the home. But what do you think happened to this sweet dog? And once again I have to say Ghost scaring people is just entertainment, but ghost scaring dogs, no. Call a priest to exercise that god ghost right now. Next up, in this weird and unexplained video, a German passenger is- I feel like the kids and like pets, like they can sense, especially dogs, they can sense something. Like little kids and yeah, it's just, I don't know, that was just sad to see the dog because you don't know what's happening and the dog is like confused and trying to figure it out but that's sad that's sad to happen to the dog but yeah board a plane flying at 30,000 feet they look out their window and are freaked out to see a bizarre shape-shifting ufo right outside their window they pull out their nikon camera and quickly record
This odd video quickly spread on Reddit and opinions on what this strange flying object could be are all over the place and pretty inconclusive. Well, that's and weird. I definitely have no idea what this could be either. But whatever it is, it's definitely weird and strange and deserves a spot in this segment. In another strange call on camera moment, a CC... That was weird as hell. Like, that was making shapes. That was not just one shape. That was making different kind of shapes. But I don't even know, man, what it is. But it's weird. You never know what's out there, I swear. Camera on an LA beach broadcast live on the website surfline.com. Early one morning, Reddit user I Survive on Coffee is watching the live camera feed when suddenly he spots something that he just can't explain. Curious viewers theorize that this could be anything from a small aircraft to a speeding jet ski, birds or bugs, or even aliens, or a sea monster. But either way, whatever this dark unexplained object is, it's moving at an incredible speed which only adds to the mystery. So what do you think it is? Let me know down below. Like I said, you don't know what is in this like the world that we live in we don't know what's out there but just be safe and stay away from because we don't know there's a lot of stuff that we really don't know what it is out there like some people say aliens some people say i don't know man but um, don't go too deep in the water be careful man fear you never know what that grave. is Paranormal so investigation team Gangwa P, which translates to Fear of Ghost yeah. Gang, sets out to explore an extremely creepy graveyard located in Thailand. The cemetery grounds holds over 200 bodies that to this day have not been claimed or identified by any friends or family members. No one knows who the unfortunate souls are, and they rest in temporary mass tombs without a name. The paranormal investigators don't explain why there are so many anonymous people buried in the graveyard, but one can only imagine the number of restless spirits that might be stalking those graves. One brave gang investigator decides to take their investigation to another level by getting down into one of the cemetery tombs and laying there all alone in the dark. As you might expect, it did not go well. Uh, what do you think? A static camera records all of the action as the experiment suddenly takes. It did not go well. Uh, don't. Why are you doing that? First of all, I would never lay down like, oh my god, no way, no way. What? No. Terrifying turn. That's a bad idea. <laughs> I'll just tell you, why did you do it? Like, why? This is what you get. Of the gang P investigator lays inside the tomb for 20 this minutes fake. before. Is this fake? Like, is this fake? Did you just see that? He just. Oh my god. Something That's seems crazy. to violently yank at his t-shirt. The investigator is terrified. He jumps out of the tomb and runs to his friends. As he explains what just happened to him, something violently pulls him backwards and he falls hard onto the cemetery ground. That's when the team decides to just get out of there. So, Where's the question the remains. Though? Is it real? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? I don't know, man. You decide. Where's the at now? Followed. You guys, that was Italian crazy, ghost but I didn't even see the guy coming back. So what happened? I'm just like, what? So now I'm suspicious. The second one, I'm like, what just happened? Like, I don't know if that was real 
But let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about this video. But it was crazy though. That scared me. Quieto TV, which translates to Restless TV, gathers his close friends to go on his very first paranormal investigation to an abandoned children's asylum in Campania, Italy. The tall building holds a gruesome past and was closed down after a young child fell from the top floor, tragically losing his life. Oh, no. Since then, the facility has been completely abandoned. As the Inquieto TV team heads inside and make their way up a staircase, they experience something truly bizarre. The soft voice of a young child can be heard and the team has no idea where it could be coming from. Right. They continue their exploration and make another strange discovery. Inside one of the abandoned asylum's rooms, the Inquieto TV team finds a few tree trunks placed in a circle. And then things take an even more terrifying turn because the explorers hear the laughter of a small child, followed by the sound of something heavy being thrown somewhere nearby. But did you see it? A small childlike shadow figure yeah, can be yeah, seen sure. right in front of them. Even creepier, whatever it is, it I seems to be following them. But I was not sure. I'm like, my eyes are playing tricks. And again, did you see it? In the corner? In the corner of the room, the same childlike figure appears again, but only for a split I second can't. before quickly disappearing. Yeah, I saw that fast. And Quieto TV had no idea that they were seemingly being followed from room to room and didn't notice the mysterious shadow figure at the time. I didn't see that one. So could this be the ghost of the child that tragically passed away inside the abandoned children's asylum? We don't know. As always, I leave it to you but to the decide. Laugh and the pay or whatever they say. Thanks for watching. Please follow me on Instagram that here. That was good, you guys. But that one was creepy. But at the end, I don't know if that was a little boy. But it was creepy, though. And I don't know for sure if that's the little boy. But let me know in the comments down below which one was the scariest. I think the the one with the, the guy getting pulled out, that was the creepiest. I hope you guys love this video. And subscribe, like, and comment. Follow me. Um, Follow me on IG, start at Ely. And yeah, thank you for our 15K, you guys. I appreciate it so much. And yeah, we guys love this video and I'll see you guys soon. Bye, you guys.